My little bit now is to talk about what we, Jellyfish Connect, are doing to hopefully help you grow your businesses. Um, I think you've probably seen this. We are calling ourselves the UK's first subscription box marketplace. We believe there's nobody else out there who's actually going to be not only promoting a load of boxes, but also actually helping sell them and actually purchase them through. There's a lot of affiliates out there, but our model is slightly different. So I'm going to talk you through some of the stuff that we will be doing. So, first of all, when are we launching? We're going to launch in June. So we've gathered everybody here today because we'd love to have as many of you on board as possible. And this is just to talk a little bit through about what we are planning on doing and seeing whether it fits with what you'd like. So uh, what are we aiming to do with your Open? We want to introduce that massive audience out there who don't necessarily know what a subscription box is yet or um, sort of know what it is. Um, to the subscription box concept and actually help get more people through the door through all of our marketing campaigns. And Matt, who is following on after me, is going to talk a lot more about that and talk a little bit through where we see the massive opportunity there. Um, we obviously want to showcase them when they come through to the site, all the range of boxes that are out there. There are so many, lots of different people here today selling lots of different products. Um, and consumers don't necessarily know all the range that's out there and what the different options are. So we want to get them all in one place on you open. Um, and the most important thing, and we've heard a lot about it today, we want to create this really positive customer experience. We realise that obviously the, the products you're doing, the discovery experience behind those is really important to make sure that people, when they actually purchase and everything else, they have that really good experience. And we offer a very high level of customer service so that we're making sure that we're generating those really engaged and very happy customers for you. So um, I suppose why list? What do we want you to do? You're going to reach millions of people. We're going to be larging, um, running large-scale digital marketing campaigns. Um, as I said before, those people looking for that discovery buying experience. Um, hopefully, when Matt talks a little bit through what he's going to be talking about, we're going to be reaching new audiences that you probably aren't reaching already yourselves. We believe that most of you are out there are not necessarily re reaching those yourselves through your own marketing channels. Um, and we're also going to, obviously, through, as I mentioned earlier, our heritage is very much in the magazine sector. We have a load of customers we know who love to buy subscriptions, whether it be a print magazine or a digital magazine. So we're going to do a lot of cross-marketing between that as well. And hopefully, if somebody's bought a food magazine, we can market a food box to them. So that is our plan. Um, I'm going to cut to the chase quite quickly, because everyone's going to say, what's it going to cost you? Um, it's going to cost you nothing to get set up. If you are on um, and choose to be listed at launch, um, you'll only pay when we actually sell a box for you. It's all going to be working on a share of revenue basis. So pretty much, it's risk-free. We hope to get as many of you on board as possible because it's not going to cost you anything. Um, just to go through what does that mean, what the actual share is that we will be taking, um, our plan is to take 15% per month while the subscription is live. And then just to cover the cost of initial acquisition up front, because obviously we'll be doing quite a lot of marketing, there'll be an additional 15% in the first month of the subscription. And then we'll make sure you get paid, obviously, and we'll send you your money, your share of the revenue, every single month, and we'll pay that directly into your bank through a self-billing process. So the administration for you is going to be pretty minimal. We'll just handle it all and just send you the money. Um, in terms of what that means, in terms of the actual breakdown, just so you're... I'm sure you're getting your heads around this saying, oh, how much money am I going to get? How much money are you taking? To give you some examples. So, for example, if the customer has bought a subscription and they are paying monthly, and they bought a monthly subscription, and they, they pay $19.99 a month. So that value is obviously, that's in the month, first month of the subscription, it's $19.99 what they paid. You get 70% of, um, of that, which is $13.99 in that first month. And then when it moves on to months two, three, and four, you get 16 99 85%. Annual subscription is obviously slightly different because obviously somebody's paying up front. We have obviously heard today that in most cases, the monthly seems to be the biggest seller, so there won't necessarily be as many of these, but obviously particularly around Christmas time where people are buying gifts, we appreciate this is going to happen. That will obviously then get divided by 12. So that is what they pay in their first month. will be 16 69 so effectively the same percentages work through. So that is how it will work in principle. Um, appreciate that everybody might have different questions, individual things about their own individual boxes. More than happy to meet with people afterwards and go through individual cases and that sort of stuff. But I just wanted to go top line through some of the commercials. So I'm going to move on to the more interesting bits. What you're going to get for free. 
you're going to get your setup. Obviously, as I said before, we know there's other online marketplaces out there that aren't dedicated subscription boxes, but are much more retail ones that do charge a fee. We don't. You're going to get your listing um, at launch. Um, um, though, any, sorry, anybody who actually comes on at launch, we're not going to charge a listing fee. Um, but we're being honest and upfront and saying that we might in time, because obviously some of the smaller boxes, if we're not getting enough volume through, there's quite an administrative cost for us to be doing that. We may charge. We don't know what that's going to be yet, but it's just something that we wanted to be upfront about. Um, and the other big thing is obviously you're going to get your marketing free. You're going to get a lot of brand exposure, and our in-house team will, can be running lots of paid marketing for your box. So going through into actually what we will do, other than obviously the marketing, and what you'll need to do. We are obviously, our aim is to drive pretty high traffic volumes to you open. Uh, we will then take the customer's orders and their payments securely through the site. We're going to offer different payment methods, uh, direct debit, credit card, um, debit cards, uh, PayPal, give customers the option to choose uh, what payment they would like and how they'd like to pay to make it as easy for them to purchase. Um, we will also manage the ongoing renewal payments and the ongoing subscription management, and I'll come on and explain why. Uh, we will manage the customer service, the initial contact, because obviously that customer has purchased through us, but obviously we will then need to liaise with you guys quite closely to say, okay, if there was an issue with the box, they've got a complaint about the box, what was that? We'll to and from with you, but obviously that customer's purchased through us, so we feel, as you guys do, you know, that customer service is hugely important and making sure that we're managing that um, effectively. Um, we will obviously provide you with a list um, of all the orders mm -hmm. and the boxes that need to be fulfilled um, on the cutoff dates that you specify, so to make sure that it's there so you know what needs to be fulfilled every single month. So all you need to do is send out the relevant box to each subscriber. So I appreciate this might be a slightly different model that you might not have come across before, but where the publishing sector is, this works very well, <laughs> particularly in the digital world. We have got a, our website called Pocket Mags. We're not only doing the acquisitions, but we're also doing the, we're actually doing the dispatch because we actually create the digital editions for them, but we're sending that out and we're doing the ongoing renewal payments and actually doing managing that ongoing subscription. We know that works very well. That's our experience, our background. There isn't just us doing that in the market. We have a direct competitor in the likes of Zinio. There's also Apple that do it, and Google Play, and Amazon, and others that do it, and they work alongside us. And they work alongside the publishers who are also doing their own activities as well. And we very much aim to be a complementary service. We're not trying to compete with what you're doing, um, but it's very much um, being complementary. And more importantly, trying to get you additional sales and reach markets that you, you're not already reaching. So, um, going into a little bit more detail in terms of what you actually had to sell on your open. Um, at launch, this is, I'm going to talk through what we will be doing. I appreciate that everybody's got a slightly different business model, different aspects. We will not be able to cater for every single little bit of personalization that you will do, but hopefully you're all going to have something that you're offering that will be able to fit into one of these options. So what will you be able to set up? If you've got multiple boxes, you'll be able to set them up all under one account login. So if you've got a cat box and a dog box, you can set them all up under the one company. So at a glance, you can see everything together rather than having to set up, you know, if you've got 12 boxes, you don't want to be setting up 12 times. All of this will be linked together. Um, you'll also be able to add all the different selection options that people might look for if you've got different variants in your box. So if somebody has, you have a T-shirt and you have different sizes, or you've got, uh, if you're selling coffee, you've got different strengths of coffee or different types of coffee. If you've got children's boxes you're seeing, what age groups they might be, or what key stages they might be, we'll be able to cater for those. And then obviously there's an element of personalization that we can bring in as well. If you need to add specific questions in, um, the example I've got here is a food box. Obviously there are a lot, a lot of people nowadays who have allergies and you'll need to know that. And then you can ask a particular question, do you have any specific food allergies that you need to know? And all of that will be tracked and will be there available with the orders that we are sending and giving to you. So the subscription options that we're going to have to start, we'll be able to take recurring monthly subscriptions. We think that's probably going to be the biggest volume going through. That's quite simple. Um, we will also offer the option to have three month subscriptions, six month subscriptions, 12 month subscriptions. The customer can select whether they want that as a non-renewing 
term, so they can buy three months up front and then tick the box to say, I don't want this to renew, or it can be a th three month subscription which automatically renews every month and the customer can then go in through their account and, and cancel that and say, I don't want this anymore if that's, if that's what they want. And we'd also, and this is where we believe there's a massive opportunity, you've seen all the stats this morning around Christmas, gift subscriptions is just huge. Um, we see this big time in the magazine world. Um, so we're going to offer from launch um, the ability for people to consumers to buy a gift subscription monthly, three, six and 12 months, and the customer can control the checkout whether they want just to do that as a one-off or they want that to automatically renew. So, um, give you a little, an idea of what your box would look like on the site. We've taken Craft Gym Club as an example. Um, so, this is what it would look like. In reality, so the consumer will be able to choose a subscription type here, what type it might be, uh, what the term might be. They can pull down the options. You can set up different options, so it's obviously clearly got the price. Um, we will be able to showcase and put lots of different images in here. So depending on what you've got, there's lots of options to either showcase an individual product within the box or open boxes or whatever there might be. There'll obviously be content here, so you can describe what's in the box. We'll obviously be gathering reviews from consumers and adding them on in time. Um, and then there's a little bit more detail here, obviously, so that we're managing expectations from the consumer about when their box is actually going to be delivered to them. So all of that will be there for the consumer. Um, and I hope you think that it's going to be a very nice way to be able to present um, the boxes, all your fantastic products, to, to people. So we are planning on managing everything as much as we can through an online portal. So you can see everything at a glance. You can add everything. You can manage things whenever you need to. You're going to have, everyone's going to have those that sign up will have an online account. So you're going to manage everything through that account for all your boxes and subscriptions. Um, and you'll set up your boxes and subscriptions via the portal. This is sort of the general um, look and feel. So you can go in and add everything. So uh, when you sign up, that's what you're going to see. Then uh, in terms of reporting, which is obviously a crucial bit for you to actually send the boxes out, you're going to get the detail. This, this is an example of all the detail of the individual orders that you're going to get. Um, you're going to get live orders, so you can go in any time and see them hopefully all ticking through. Um, you're going to know the specific customer details, the sales that that customer's made, maybe they've maybe they bought two products um, or exactly what term they bought, plus the revenues. You better see up front those recurring orders, those that are sitting there ready to be banked that are in that for the next month's delivery or future months rolling through. Um, and then you're going to get a monthly summary um, as well as a monthly summary report, which gives you all the total volumes, the revenues, and obviously the revenue share, just so that you get a summation of that. And at the end of that month, when that month is done, that's when we'll send um, you your revenues for that month and it will go into your account. And obviously, it's really important you obviously get your fulfillment order reports, um, those, as I said earlier, will be based on your custom monthly schedules, whatever you want to set up in the system, so that you are in complete control of what you're doing. Everybody delivers on different dates, so we want to make sure we can cater for that. Um, and all of those orders which need to be fulfilled, you can just export the list and uh, easy uh, for you to then pull off and know who you're going to do. The other thing that we're going to provide in the portal is an online help desk. We will obviously be there in the background. Um, everything we're going to try and do online, but obviously we'll be on the telephone as well if needed, um, to make sure that we're supporting the listing, all the subscriber management, um, customer service aspects, anything like that will all be there so you can have that um, online portal. Um, the other big thing that we're going to do, which is sort of, this is the kickstart of it, is actually be there to help and support you as well. We are going to be creating a load of online um, blogs, resources, uh, best practice, case studies. We've obviously heard from um, four people today about what's going on. We'd love to get more insight from all of you and hear from all of you about what you're doing and share that when you're, if you're willing to so that others can learn and sort of just hints and tips about good practice and, and what's working for you all. Um, and also we're going to get some stuff from the States as well because we appreciate that there's a, you know, that market is very, very developed in the US and see what we can do. And we hopefully will be running more events like this. The phenomenal turnout we've had today has just been amazing. So we've had to turn people away. So we are planning to do more of these going forwards. We may have some for brand new boxes who just don't know where to start and what to do. And we're going to help handhold them through. But lots more opportunity. Um, so hopefully, um, post the event, we're going to send a survey out. And we'd love to hear ideas of other things that you would like to hear from, um, other things you'd like to share, other ways of networking you'd like to get together. So, what next? 
If you want to come on board, if you want to be a launch partner, go to youropen.com. It's live now. Formally register your interest via the online form. Just sign up. Then we will, after that, we're going to start basically sending you logins through April and May, asking you to actually add your boxes onto the site, ready for launch in June. So that's it in a nutshell. <laughs> I appreciate it's short, sharp. There's lots of questions that may come up. Um, I know there's lots of individual boxes have got different things that we might not be able to cater for at launch. We are going to look at those. We will have an ongoing roadmap after launch to start rolling those out. And that's part of today is to hear from you all to find out what other things you'd like to make sure that we've got ideas in our heads, but we also want to know what you want to be doing so that we can make sure that we're there supporting you and hopefully growing subscriptions and the overall market for everybody, to everybody's benefit. So.